Hey guys, welcome to the third online lesson. And this time we're going to talk about comparing integers. What we're going to do is we're going to figure out greater than, less than, and we're going to put numbers, or should I say integers, in order. So let's get started. First thing is, on your worksheet, is I gave you a tip. And my tip is that the larger number is to the right. So please, pause the video and jot down that tip, because we're going to use it. Okay. Next, what we're going to do is we are going to figure out if numbers are greater than or less than, and we're going to use a number line. So, on your worksheet there, the first work we're going to do is we're going to compare 12 and negative 4. And I give you a number line. So, 12, is it greater than or less than negative 4? Now, what I want you to do is use the number line. So, let me get my drawing pen out. And slide it over this way. And I'll select red. Red's a good color. 12 and negative 4. First thing I want to do is plot where is 12 and where is negative 4. You'll notice that on my number line, every five integers are labeled. But still, there's little integer lines that we can use to represent integers. So 10, 11, 12. Here's 12 negative 4, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4. And we'll plot that right there. So if you remember my tip, the larger the number, the more to the right that it is. So just looking at it, 12 is much more to the right than what negative 4 is. Therefore, 12 is greater than negative 4. Let's look at the next one. The next one is negative 3 and negative 1. Well, what I want you to do is pause the video and plot where negative 3 and negative 1 are on your number line. Okay, you should have plotted where they are, but let me plot them. So, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3. I will plot negative 3 there. And negative 1. Negative 1 is right there. Well, it's right there. There. Okay. Negative 3 and negative 1. Which one is more to the right? Well, negative 1 is. So therefore, negative 3 is less than negative 1. Next up, let me clear this out. No. Okay. Up next, what I have is I gave you a set of four numbers, negative 10, 5, negative 15, and 20. What I want you to do is use the number line. First, plot out all of your numbers. Show me where negative 10, 5, negative 15, and 20 are on the number line. Pause the video and go ahead and do that. Okay, as you're doing that, I will pull up my pen and plot these numbers. I'll use blue. Okay, first thing, order the set. First number is negative 10. So what I will do is I will plot where negative 10 is. Next number is 5. The next number is negative 15. Negative 15 is right about there. And sorry, my pen was not cooperating. And positive 20. Positive 20 is right there. So we have to put these in order from least to greatest. So what number is the least? Well, the least is negative 15. Up next negative 10. Notice when I'm doing least to greatest, what I'm doing is I'm just starting at the far left and I'm going to work my way to the right. The next one up is 5. And the last or the greatest number is 20. Excellent. So when you're ordering your set, first plot the numbers on the number line and then look 
Which numbers are the further left? Those are the smaller numbers. The numbers to the far right, those are the larger numbers. So this will conclude our integers um, and ordering and comparing integers. And we'll see you next time.